Hello, welcome to Stellaris. I knew that was going to happen. Started playing it twice. Hello. Let me just get back to the page I need. Solaris is going to watch to see if there's something you would like to buy. So many people say it's too damn good. It is. It's on, I believe it's in the sale that's currently going on. I may be right. I may be wrong. I'm not 100% sure. I need Discord open because this is multiplayer. Now, uh, our actual multiplayer isn't set to start until four o'clock my time on the dot, which is 10 minutes away. But, uh, hold on. Some Stellaris sound would be quite nice too. How about that? I need to create a new empire because I want to play as a machine. And holy crap, are the machine portraits really, really good. I mean, look at this guy. <laughs> so they're all based on all the other ones. So you've got the humanoid machine, which kind of reminds me a bit of Zenyatta if you've played Overwatch, which is kind of cool. Um, uh, believe this yeah this is the mammalian one he looks kind of like he should be in fallout which is pretty sweet the reptilian one who's kind of cool this one just looks like mercy from overwatch and no surprise with the wings that's the avian one the arthropoid one that looks nasty that's yeah this just looks like a kind of a beholder type thing which is pretty cool uh that's the molluscoid one yes this is the fungoid one which is pretty cool. Mm, yeah, it's quite pretty. And then the no, not him, him, the um, the plantoid one. And then you have your generic. This is the synth that you've been able to build for a while as a mechanist. But um, yeah, these guys. I do love these ones. Robotic blog, yeah. So I'm gonna go for these. Um, and I'm gonna go with the Mercy Confederacy. No. Yeah, we'll just call them the Mercy, I'll change them afterwards. So, the plural of Mercy is going to be Mercy. And it's going to be Mercian, no surprise there. Um, names, 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 names. Now this is really cool because you can give your machines any kind of name that you want. Um, some of the machine names are kind of crap. What's the humanoid ones like? Eh, I don't really like those ones either. Oh, why is my phone going off? I should probably stop that. Hive my names, Hapa. No. Um. Ooh, the ship names on that one are nice enough. That'll do. Traits. Now I'm kind of biased when it comes to traits. Let me just move my phone out of the way. There we go. Um. Mm, I like superconductive. Just because it makes life easier. So I'm probably going to pick superconductive. Um, but then I like having extra traits. What do I want? Build speed. Eh, I don't really mind about experience gain, to be fair. So I can then pick... Where is it? Mm, efficient processors. Eh, efficient processors or power drills. It's always a problem. Hmm. 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 Efficient processors. Sure. Uh, starting ruler name. Oh, I'm so bad at this. Uh, Layla. Why the heck not? Uh, now the colour variants. Now some of these colour variants are pretty cool. I love that red one. For start. But I don't know. They're all pretty cool. I like that one. Uh, I'm going to go with the red ones. You can change which room they're in. I just pick one at random. That one will do. Oh, I wonder what the hell that was going to do to me then. Trons? No. Uh, I'm going to call my homeworld Aceris. That was an Eve reference. Uh, and I'm going to screw it all up by calling the star name Safazon because, you know, why not? Um, it doesn't really matter what I pick for this. Let's go for Tundra because, again, why not? I like the avian cities, so I'm going to go avian. And it fits with the avian phenotype. Now, when you're making a machine empire, you have to pick just consciousness to be able to unlock a machine intelligence. Uh, yeah, leader recruitment cost is more expensive. Yeah, da, 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 da. You don't need food because you're a robot. Hey, two civic picks. Now, this is where you pick the fun things like determined exterminators, driven assimilators, and rogue servitors, which are the three, three main things, the kind of like themes 
that people tend to make, but there's a ton of other really, really cool combinations. I like actually playing as Warbots, but it only does damage with your armies, it doesn't affect your ships. Unitary Cohesion is, in my opinion, pretty damn good, because your unity skyrockets. And it's your unity that you use to buy very useful stuff, so... I don't use edicts a whole lot, if I'm honest. Build speed I've already got. Mineral production is good because what are robots made out of? Minerals! So, um, uh, rock breakers is pretty good. Static research analysis if you like customising your research, which I usually pick, but I'm probably not going to today. Um, yeah. Building costs, things like this. Um, I don't think I'm going to go with any of the main three. I don't really give a damn about the research speed because there's other ways to do that. So I might actually go rock breakers. I have a plan. It's not a very good plan. But it's a plan. Um, so the advisor voice has been split out into- You seem overworked. Have you considered joining a union? Whoa! Space! Just pacifist module. Alert. Possible organic yeah, okay. life form detected. We're going to be Seek, hearing this a lot. Isolate, destroy. So I'm going to stick with machine intelligence one. My empire name is the not the Mercy Nexus Confederacy. There we go. Because I like Confederacy. Now a flag. Do you have a flag? Well, no, I don't yet, but I'm going to make one. So, oh, why is my computer lagging so much? Come on. I know I'm streaming, but it's not usually that bad. Um, mm, 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 not the Paradox logo. Though I will give a cookie to anyone who can tell me what the Paradox logo actually is. There's one for you. Let's go with this. That seems to fit with our names. Uh, secondary colours are going to be the very bright yellow. Primary colours... Yes, that looks quite nice actually. And I quite like it on that background. Don't like that so much. That's quite nice. Like a sunrise. Let's do this. Starting weapons, projectile weapons, because they are overpowered as shit. I... okay. Warp travel is great. Wormhole travel is annoying as hell, because you have to build wormhole stations. I actually quite like hyperspace. Just the Empire Maker is making you want to buy this. Well, it's pretty damn cool. Um, mm, I might go arthropoid ships, actually. Have avian city and arthropoid ships. Let's do this. Yes, okay. Save. Mercy Confederacy is done. Uh, I'm going to turn Iron Man mode off because I do not want that. I do, however, need to find out what our game rules were going to be because we... I say we decided that. Um, it was... had some help being... I was like, I don't know what to play. So a huge elliptical. Uh, no AI empires. Three fallen empires, which is terrifying. Somewhere between 5 to 10 of those. Uh, primitive civil... <sighs> See? Primitive civs and habitable worlds all the way up. That's... That's not how I'd normally play this game. But Empire Placement is going to be random. Why am I doing this? I just realised I need to set this up as a multiplayer game. Burp. Uh, I'm going to put this back in for a moment while I do the hosty stuff. Um, I'm going to do this and host it. Let's give our players some time to get in and I will need to tell them... Ugh, don't need that. I'll fix that in a minute. Um, go. I have told the couple of players that we have. I thought we were having more players than that. Oh well. Uh, let's go and find my little piece of paper. So, thousand stars elliptical, uh, five to ten AI empires, no advanced AI starts, three fallen empires, max primitive civilizations, we are... I... Yeah. Yeah, okay, we'll keep the crisis strength of 1.5 times. Low AI aggressiveness, because, yeah. Uh, 
any FTL method, advanced neighbors, no empire placement, clusters, random. Leviathan synthetic on Utopia, excellent. I'm gonna select my empire. Uh, did I? No, I didn't. Let's take this off, hello. I'm gonna select my empire, my mercy confederacy, and wait for people to join. Well, wait for the rest of the people who I expect to be coming to join. Okay, so we have at least three more players joining. One of them. Yeah, they're on their way. Excellent. We are going to be starting pretty much on time. This is good. So here is a good time to ask questions about the game. I've played a fair bit of it. I quite like it. But yes, if you like the Empire Maker stuff, there is so much you can do with all these. Uh, I mean, I've made two before. I made... Um, there's so many different... Uh, let's actually just have a look at this because I can do this at the moment. I mean, you've got various different types of humanoid, various like alien style humanoid, including something that's like fairly Vulcan. Uh, machines have already been through mammalian. Not all of these come with the base game, some of these are uh, from the various DLCs. I particularly like these guys, they were my um, Paradox Forum avatar for a long time, the, uh, the fox-like ones. It's pretty cool. I mean, they're just cool. They're just, I mean, he's got three eyes on each side of his face. It's awesome. Oh, I skipped this guy. Yeah, with his really long, like, llama neck, but a, a weird face and wings. It's cool. And then the porcupine dude. Reptiles. Reptiles, again, you can probably already see which one my favourite one's going to be. But, um, you've got a whole array of different ones. Some of the kind looks like Silurians from Doctor Who. It's awesome. Oh, so much of this game is just so good. And then these guys. How adorable are these guys? And that shows you that it's a female version. And these guys. Uh, I believe these are from either the Leviathans or the Utopia pack. Or they came in one of the anniversary portrait packs. Um, but these guys, they're pretty cool. I like them. Uh, avians. Tons of different avian ones as well, including this guy. He's got like a bubble on his head. It's like he doesn't breathe oxygen, he breathes something else, so he needs it. It's like toucan style ones, cockatoos with four eyes. It's pretty cool. Ah. Oh. And then the peacocks. Uh, Devouring Flock, I think, was the uh, stream where they used the peacocks as their, their people. Like, arthropoids. You don't really expect arthropoids to be interesting. But then you look at what you can do with them, and they're really cool. This guy reminds me of, um, oh, what's his name from Monsters, Inc? I can't remember his damn name, the purple guy. The bad guy, basically. But yeah, you've got, like, space cockroaches. These adorable little butterfly feathers, fellas. I quite like these as well, and the arthropoid, um... Machine, I believe, is based on this one. I may be wrong on that. I'm willing to be corrected. And then you got blah 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 sex. It's good. Oh, molluscoids, basically slugs. But and then you have these guys, the space starfish and the space snails. Who wouldn't want to be? Okay, you go from the bizarre to the cute end of the spectrum in this game. Uh, fungoid. Oh, hello! People should recognise those. And those! Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> They're probably one of the, the weirdest, most well-known characters in Stellaris. But yeah, there's a ton. I mean, you've literally just got a walking mushroom, which is pretty cool. And these! Again, we go from the, the what to the, oh, it's adorable. Space snail and space hydra, exactly. It's great. And even plants, like Venus flytrap. These, I like playing these guys. I used to have an empire made with these guys, actually. They were um, like a research-based empire. They were really cool. They were good fun to play. And then, like... It's like a radish... pumpkin head thing? <laughs> I don't even know. That's basically just Groot's angrier older brother, is what I like to call that guy. Yeah, and then this, which... Looks like it should be in a Slender Man game. But yeah, so there's the Empire creator in itself is just 
amazing. There's so much you can do. And that's before you get into all the different traits and and things like that. And if you're playing with um, the Machine Empire, things like if you are a rogue servitor, you have a empire that you used to serve. And that are now your bio trophies. So you pick your machine empire and then you get to choose another empire to be your bio trophies. So you can be like a really cool machine with the cute little lizard guys or space snails. Whatever you want. It is it is adorable. It is really cool. So we have two of the three people. I think the last person looks like they're just getting in. It's pretty good. Uh, I'm reading the wrong Discord channel. That doesn't help. Oh yeah, okay, that would have been useful. Oops, I probably should have done that. I will jump into the Discord at some point. I will possibly have to change the volume of it. Um, but then you'll be able to hear the other wonderful players. There we go. Splix. More robots. <laughs> and fourth player is incoming. So we were discussing earlier about having the crisis strength amp amped up to five times. Now, I have played against the um, the end game crisis in Synthetic Dawn. It's bloody tough, unless you know what you're doing and unless you have prepared for it and unless you have some damn good luck. Um, I am actually going to be bailing on this game before we get to that point in the game because the end game crisis doesn't spawn until at least 150 years in. Uh, I'm only going to be playing this game for about three hours because that is all that my brain can take at this moment in time. Um, but I will be leaving the other three players to carry on their game and I will be expecting a nice after action report from them. I haven't told them that yet but I guess if they're watching the stream then they'll probably know that now. <laughs> so I'd like an AAR from you guys after it's been done. One more still to come, and then we are all good. And we're playing on a huge elliptical galaxy. In fact, you know what? While I have time to fix the audio, I'm going to jump into the Discord. A Murphud's version of robots. Indeed. Hello. 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 I'm in. Thunderbar. Whoop, whoop. Bring on the potatoes. Potatoes. Space potatoes. Oh my god. They're evil radishes. They're <laughs> clearly potatoes. I've never seen a potato that colour before. Red potato. That's because it's in space. Uh, okay. <laughs> that's that's fair. That's fair. In space everything turns red? Well, no, but space robots turn sentient. This is oh. true. It all. I feel uncomfortable with everyone <laughs> plotting to turn me into a cyborg. Nobody's looking at you like you're some meat bag made for harvesting. I, I will spoil you now, I am not playing as a driven assimilator, so you're fine. I am! Uh, we oh. are! <laughs> oh, crap. Oh shit, there's three robot empires. Oh, damn it. I'm in trouble. It's new. Okay, if you're all good, you're all readied up, I'm gonna start. Then again, you can't assimilate already robots, I guess. This is a good point. Can't make cyborgs out of something that's <laughs> Cyborg. not human fleshy. <laughs> I am going to ask one thing. If anyone finds the system named Gargantuan, please let me know. Will do. That sounds like I want that now. So yeah, you're Super here... Uh... Secret. The Discord stuff uh, interjecting over this, but I'm on push to talk, so they can't I'll hear have me. All the solar time. panels. It's <laughs> pretty cool. Uh, I'll give everyone a minute to get set up, and then I'll unpause. <laughs> well, uh, I'm probably gonna need fire to all the researchers, researchers that aren't maniacal or something. Well, that's an that's an that's an evil first choice. Uh, surely that. you've got to go for research speed plus five percent over solar panel network. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember, robots have increased the cost for hiring people. So don't immediately fire everyone. Yes, they do. They have a hundred plus a hundred percent cost. There's no better hiring opportunities. Except so, for... where am I in the galaxy? I am this little right uh, cyber lizard here, but he's gonna die eventually. 
all hail the cyber lizard. Wait, no, they're robots. They don't die. Well, no, that's my second species. Oh, your cyborgs. They can die. Bio trophies. Space battle bears. Also, the robots can totally die. Malfunction? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It says that my... my uh, thingy is immortal. My scientist. Yeah, but they break down. Yes. Surely you can fix them. So what's somebody um, required? No spoilers, but yes, sort of. <laughs> right, are we good to go? I'm good. Yup, I'm good. Uh, ah, apparently out of sync. Synchronized. No, oh. Number count, num fleets, num ships. Everything's out of sync. What the heck? I have no idea, but it's paused for me anyway. Yeah. Uh, you're gonna have to leave and rejoin. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. So it begins. Their multiplayer backend has changed since last we played. And this happened. Um... Yay for hot joining features? Uh, I'll take a save here as well, just in case. But you should be able to uh, hot join the, the game, yeah. Yeah, I just restarted the entire thing of a bob. Oh, that's loading. Whereabouts is everybody in the galaxy? As I'm kind of Spoilers. top right. Kind of like five o'clock ish. What? I'm not sure I'm comfortable letting you know anymore. <laughs> I'm just below the pit That camera. sounds like Stans doesn't want to play a peaceful game. Welcome to the wonderful <laughs> world of multiplayer. He's building just, up a fleet. Just looking out for my potatoes. Stans is lunch. Potato chips, anyone? It's not a good lunch. Potato That's chips lunch. for lunch is totally legit. So yeah, so I've picked Solar Panel Network um, because robots take a lot of energy to use. Um, and naval capacity because I'm going to have to go to war at some point. And then obviously building... Uh, what did everyone call their home world as well? We'll be good curiosity. Too. That's the only thing I ran them, so I don't know. <laughs> Fair enough. I called mine Nisaros. I... Eerie. Um, I called it Spatopia. <laughs> Oh, move the potato. Yes, backslash is my push to talk key. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. We all good? Yup. Yep. So it doesn't desync instantly. Yay! Oh, I think we very fast. Yes, I've turned it back down again. I don't know why it was so loud, so fast. Do we want it on normal or fast? I'd say start fast. Yeah. Okay. Be a little bit slower to start anyway. So what I like to do is I, I like to just send my my basic corvettes off. We start with somewhere. better base minerals now, I guess. Yay, no food requirements. An orange planet, you say? I was going to say, I potentially have towards now orange? Yeah, it seems so. Well, we are, well, okay. I was going to say, we are machines, so therefore we don't really care. Apparently but, we do. I mean, dust but, can get into the servo <laughs> systems. Uh, did anyone notice how much a uh, colony ship costs now, by the way? Not yet. Wow. Uh, I, I did crazy. go through the patch notes, I know that it went up. Is it like <laughs> 600 or something? It's 500, 500. now. It's been doubles. Nice. There are ways to bring it back down to like, I think 260 or something. That's really expensive. Well, Ooh, we're gonna have to spend our entire lifetime on this one planet, guys. Better build close together. Yay for fast it's build speed option? Yeah. So my construction ship is doing jack all at the minute because there is nothing for it Go to do. Go science ship, do your thing. So yeah, I'm just sending everyone <laughs> out across the galaxy. So these my things, science these, robot these, is carefree. You can see these these lines. These are called the hyperlanes. Well, so these to get between to be systems because I picked the hyperlane propulsion That's mode. A bit more accurate. It's carefree until it's not carefree. 
So there is an alien system, like, three away from my capital. If it's a fallen empire, I might actually cry. <laughs> Placate them. Placate a fallen empire, sure. As a machine yeah, yeah, empire yeah. that everyone will probably hate. Sometimes they just want to put your people into zoos and then you give them some people and then they're really happy and give you really powerful starships. Yay. I have a battle bear in charge System of System survey complete. That doesn't sound like a good idea. Why not? Where's Veer? Veer's not around. Sounds like oh, a legit I idea. Battle bears don't really sound sciencey. He has plus five research speed. Battle bears don't sound sciencey. There is someone no. here playing as a potato. <laughs> well, I'm not I'm not saying Stans is gonna have the best science. Lord, he's gonna problem. he's probably gonna have the best farms. You'd hope so. He's the only one who cares about farms anyway. So <laughs> it's true. I didn't think of that. <laughs> At least that's one thing we can get rid of when we start eating him. <laughs> so now I'm just sending my science ship to go survey more things. You can queue things up. I did not know that for the longest time. I'm really glad that I learned that. Wow, worst home system ever. Just Construction minerals, complete. That's it. Nothing else. Yep, same for mine actually. My, 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 my... Ooh, beta aliens. My star is generally pretty bad as well. Alert, fleet unit offline. Space amoebas straight away. That's I've got a soul not good. system, and the only thing it's that actually has here. anything okay. is. The moon, which has minerals on it. Sure. Also, not a. Ugh. Oh yeah. I see the orange uh, planets are probably planets that you don't know how habitable they are yet because you haven't surveyed them. Correct. Mystery planets. A foreign entity has decreased. Have made first contact with an alien empire. It's they appear to have Germany. mastered spaceflight just as we have. I recommend a healthy degree of caution sure, until yeah. we learn their intentions. Okay, so this is the fun thing. How may I assist you? How may I assist you? Yes, yes. Is oh, something wow. the matter? Oh dear, this I is not some a sort of use creepy of your time. Or alien they warned me this would happen. DNA storage inside of an asteroid. This does not help our mission. Do you think this what? is some kind of game? Caramel core? No. I am, by any practical point. definition of the words, foolproof a guy and incapable an of error. I'm sure it's perfectly queen fine. to bishop three, <laughs> bishop takes queen. If it's Knight 25 size. Mate. Surrender is a perfectly acceptable it. alternative in extreme All circumstances. The holy a strange game. The only winning move is not to play. My instructor taught me to sing a song. If you'd like Sorry, to I'm hear just it, playing around with I can you. sing it for you. Daisy, Daisy, what is a Veer? Veer's the advisor. Oh. oh, machines have advisors? Well, Veer's just the tutorial guy, he's in it all the time. Isn't he? Ah. But um, I discovered that if you click on him, and if you keep clicking on him, he'll start quoting things at you. And he actually does end up by singing Daisy, Daisy. <laughs> So that's the only reason I kept tips on during this game, is so I could do that. Make the poor advisor dance for your amusement. Hell yeah. Turn, in, turn into Hal. Yeah, okay, what are you guys like? Let's have a look at you guys. Oh, they're receptive, hello! Non-aggression pact, please. Hey, look, it's the people I actually like. I like that I must that construct thing. additional pylons. see what they say. Did they say? But you don't have enough minerals. Yes, yes, the non-aggression. Indeed, pack. excellent. I have plenty of energy. It's not enough minerals. System survey complete. There's nothing for us in that one. I don't need that anymore. Oh yeah, you're supposed to build robots. Yeah. Yes. It always helps. They don't automatically populate your planets. Although you have got the build multiple button now, which is handy. On the other hand, what if we? Build like a tiny factory inside of each robot, but only half a factory, so you need two robots to come together to build a new robot. That's Power... robot, robot procreation right there. Exactly. Power overwhelming. Uh, more aliens. I kind of want to research them. Special project complete. Oh good, space amoebas. Uh... A pre-sapient species. Let's do that. Well, let's cyborg it. Let's not do that. I actually need to. All the hell, the battle bears! So I have a non aggression pack with the people next door to me. This is good. This is good. I have discovered Alpha Zephyr. Ooh, hello, habitable world. Planetary alert. Tile blocker expunged. Hmm. 
Single mass of water. Oh, the automated dreadnought. Oh, good. I found the automated dreadnought. Yay. Oh, dear. I found the, the surface variable giant detected. evil space fortress of doom. <laughs> These people are finding the, 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 the horrible, horrible things. Oh, it's fine. Hang on. Why is my destruction ship? Until it's not. Oh, yeah, it's not within our borders. Boo, I can't do anything with it. Isn't the cyborg species supposed to repopulate? Um, oh. I don't think it's got population control on, has it? That's a good point. You, view species. Yes, it has got population control. Please stop climbing non. I want full of the bombardment, oh. please. Let's take Let's contact Yeah. Or even yeah. separates. Sure, that'll do. Breed, battle bears, breed! Ooh, I have a hive mine nearby. Ugh. It's not great, but I can pick this. Hmm, what do I want to pick? I quite like going supremacy. Wow, living standards really non existent. We do not budget for the dead. Mm. <laughs> wow. Expansionist is pretty good. Domination. I don't, yeah, I don't really go domination. Prosperity is pretty good. It makes everything cheaper, which is good. Oh, the only pop -up world I find. Synchronicity is Empire. basically just machine empires. Um, oh, what the Gaia world? Yeah. Uh, it's in the same system. Oh, well, well, no, I don't do that fine. very often. Let's go for it. Oh, I need that to be in our border. You can't let them procreate at all. <laughs> Cyborg say no to sex. Apparently. Uh, we can build another pop. And we are going to build another pop. System survey complete. In Grumman. Now, as I mentioned to the other guys, cost for a colony ship did go up to 500 like with dance. this expansion. So, there is a world, what is it? It's a 23! I want it! It's a tundra! Oh, it's beautiful. So I'm gonna, like, as soon as I tick over to uh, 500 minerals, I will get a colony ship because, goddamn, I want that 23 world. Interesting thing about the robots, though, is I'm not actually bothering taking the expansion tradition style. Yeah. <laughs> Did anyone else take synchronicity? I went discovery, actually. Ah. So did I. I like Figure. the fact that none of us have picked the one that makes us for allows us to form a federation. Ah, we'll, that we'll get to that eventually. <laughs> The world starts looking a little bit scary, when the galaxy looks a little bit more scary, rather. Why is my ship there and... Well, it's moving, but doesn't... it's not actually. Where are you? Where did you end up? You ended up all the way over there. Ibanic Vale, okay. Head up here. Go ahead, go enjoy. You're over there, okay. You go and enjoy. It'll be fine. Oh, really? Colony ship is building. Service population is building. I'm going to leave those tile blockers in place for now. The first alien encounter is like two systems above me. Oh, nearly I done. I haven't encountered an alien yet, which is good. Oh, no, 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 no. Right of our... <laughs> <laughs> there goes that sign, ship. Eh, Too far away. Anyway. Well, I'm officially now trapped in. I should probably build another another science. The Stellarite Devour, like, blocking my route down south, and this other Magic empire levels. blocking my route up north. You and your silly hyperlane. I know. Seemed like such a good idea at the time. Hyperlanes are good. Unless there's a Stellar Devour in the way. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. Which is exactly what happens. It's still better than wormholes, though. Yeah, those are just a pain in the ass. Oh, it was the sign ship that had the bow bear on it as well. <laughs> At least he fought. What am I doing? Nine months left on my solar panels. <sighs> so, they've oh, met the people. Galaxy this large. Hmm. Uh, well, this is huge, I suppose. We normally play large. And the first enemy. I mean, possible friend. <laughs> <laughs> there are no friends in space. Robot ally. System survey complete. It's 
A foreign entity has encrypted our communications. The candidates around me really are terrible. Oh, you're a machine! <laughs> the fig yar... Oh, I got two Wait. hive minds near me. Oh yeah, the one just above me is a hive mind. Oh. Yeah, it's a fallen empire right next to me. Uh, let's see they don't seem to... Agreement. No, okay. Eat or like me. The other hive mind. They're wary. That. Construction complete. Yeah, okay. But can they? Not great. Hey! Yeah, so they seem go. to be fine. Ooh. What's this? 18 and an 18. 18. No, nothing beats the 23. I'm going to take the 23. Was it 5% failure chance. Okay. I haven't seen a 5%. Oh, that one? Even 0 or 10%. Ooh. Okay. That's fine. Look at all these systems! With... Oh, yes, of course, because we turn half I'm also a little bit worried here. that I have a maniacal. Like robot. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Indeed. <clears throat> Machine uprising. Uh, I've just approached a gargantua black hole. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Where is it? Uh, I don't know. I'm trying to find now. <laughs> uh, what's the search? It's like a search thing. F. Just for surf, yeah. F. Yeah. Technological acquisition successful. Type giant black hole. Ooh, let's do research speed. And now I can. It is at about nine o'clock, right in the middle. Oh yikes! Ooh, satanic life. That's right. on the opposite end of the galaxy from me. I think System I have a ship heading out complete. that way. Congratulations on having colonized the. Thank you, Vir. Great day for the Mutti Confederacy. And my scientist has left. A foreign up. entity has decrypted our communications. Well, I think I found a fallen empire, and it's a nice fallen empire. Hooray! Doesn't By nice, I mean probably empires? not going to kill me straight away. Which ones? Custodians? Holy guardians. Ah, uh, the ones next to me are holy guardians. System survey complete. Ah, the ones next to me are... Sintamori Watchers. Yep, those are the ones I just found. Aha! Oh, my construction ship. You'd think with colony ships costing 500 minerals now that they would make them a little more energy efficient. But no, it still sucks up all your energy. Yep. Oh, hello! I found the, uh... Rogue Drones! <laughs> I don't know where you are though, I say I've found you and then I can't actually see where on the map you are. Construction complete. Oh, you are right next to me. Okay, I'm right next to you. There's a solar system, the system's right at the bottom of like where I am. You can see where I am. And there's a group of like one, two, three, four systems that are kind of oh, joined together. Foolish Corvette. The one that is an F-type star has the Stellarite Devourer in, so I recommend not going in there. Oh, the, yeah, the class F star, okay. Shasamar. Well, I won't send my ships down there then, thank you for warning me. <laughs> yeah, I probably need to expand over here. Nodro. What kind of Negative energy have? already. Wow, that didn't take long. 18. This is where solar panel generators Anomalous are. Anomalous surface variable detected. Let me build some. Uh, this guy has finished his exploring. He can now go up here. Enjoy. See who else I can find. He may or may not have a trade already. That's a good start. I think this is a very construction complete. System. Hostile fleet assets engaged. Ooh, Batarian power plant research. Wow. Horror in the void. Oh dear. Everything will be fine. Zantara's oh. black hole just ate my ship. Nom 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 nom. Dimensional horror. Lovely. If I you keep feeding it, it won't get hungry, and it won't 
get out. Haven't we just found all the bosses within like the first 20 minutes of play? Something like that. I was just trying to find the gargantuan black hole, because I like it. Yeah, let's not Wait, have we found have, have we found the razor survey complete? Thanks. I hear they suck. Oh. Uh... Hey. No, that is not a worthy at all. Uh, you need a power. Well, that's to exactly work. why we want to find the wraith. We want to have their vacuum attachment. <laughs> we produce it. Let's do that. Uh, I don't need to. Build Construction it. complete. Yes, that'll work. Coming along now, my colony. This is my construction ship. Is this in my space yet? No, it's not in my space yet. It's like a generally it. evil place here. You've got Gargantua, you've got Abaddon's Demesna, however you pronounce that, and Zucani's Black Hole, all next to each other. That's just like the Portal of Doom area. Technological acquisition successful. Hey, what have I researched? Naval capacity, excellent. I have hired a new Perfect. <laughs> so somewhere. Damn, battle bears yeah. selling their services to the highest bidder. Indeed. All, All hail, hail the battle bears. Battle bears. <laughs> <laughs> Construction ship still has nothing to do. I need that to come under my jurisdiction. Do robots get pirates? As in, can they encounter them? No, that you get like the piracy mm -hmm. faction and it's gonna blow up one of your uh, mining stations at the start. Oh, when, it, when the starting events. I haven't encountered it myself. At least it's that. I don't know. Construction complete. So the slow early game is pretty good. Oh, finally, good one. Yay! Oof. Foolish scouting corvette, don't attack hostile stations. You cannot win! <laughs> don't set them too aggressive. Yeah, the evasive uh, fleet stance has been removed. Oh. You can only be passive or aggressive now. I was not happy when I discovered that. But I liked my science vessels normally running away. No, well, your, your science vessels will, it's your um, military fleets that you can no longer set to evasive. More aliens. I don't really want to spend the time to figure out who they are. I'm just gonna keep the running. first league. Okay, I haven't heard of them before. It takes 42 months to colonize a planet. Yeah, it takes ages for me as well. I don't know if that's just a machine thing or if that's a new thing. I think it depends on the terrain. Anomalous surface variable detected. Technological Ooh, acquisition successful. Mmm, it's only a 15. There's a tomb world there as well. Sheesh. So there's an 18 and a 10 there. Two 18s there. I might just go for one of these two 18s actually. What are they? Continental and an ocean. The system of Sheliac. Uh, 50% light of a breakdown. Building build speed increased. Unrest reduced. I don't have a problem with unrest right now, so let's do this. Hey, the system of wonton. They do soup there. Wonton? Uh, let's go coil gun, because weapons are good. Oh, I'm going to be lazy as well. I'm going to go ship designer. Um, auto upgrade, auto complete. So now it'll just automatically, whenever so I reset it, species. better. species. Yeah, they're on five times. Ah, I see. See, because I can eat them. Nom nom nom. And you can eat them. Nom nom nom. They're just pointless for me. <laughs> this is an annoyance. Do I have enough? No, I don't. Ooh, moo aliens. Moo. Do I have any more buildings need to be built? No. Ooh, yes. So these are, uh, they're not traders. I can't remember. Researchers. What? What is this? Oh. Oh. 
Oh. Well, that's not good. I don't like the fact that that's coming towards me. Let's ignore that. <laughs> Let's hope it doesn't come my way. Did you find Gargantia yet? No. My uh, Corvette is being ridiculously slow. It's probably more... It's, 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 yeah, it's around about 8 o'clock. Near the, near the middle. There's a lot of black holes fairly close to the middle, actually. Yeah, the, the Gindor black holes there. Brune Singularity, which I think I've had it's in every It's above Gindor. Above Gindor? System survey Gindor. complete. What you just said, Gindor black hole. Oh, okay. I'm fairly close to it then. Let's just send my guys over here until they find it. I do like the gargantuan black hole. Can my construction ship build anything yet? Is this in my space yet? No. Oh man, even border expansion so slow. Uh, you're ready to have a network built. Enjoy that. Recruit a new science officer. Science Officer Autonomous Drone 2679? No, Valentina Morales. Wow. He's a Latina bot. <laughs> Hola. He's only programmed in Spanish. <laughs> now I've just got flashbacks to Red versus Blue. It's just permanently stuck on. Madre de Dios. <laughs> oh, all these colonies and technological acquisitions God successful. Yeah. So slow. Yeah, this is a very, very slow early game. Mm, I should. Ooh. Investigate gigantic Physics skeletons. Labs, please. How about no? Planets and sectors. I have two planets. I don't really need anything else from that right now. Pontian Edicts? Yeah, I don't really need any edicts active right now. Uh, I don't have any strategic resources. There will never be any factions because I'm a machine empire. Construction so complete. My leaders are okay. I don't like using the expansion planner actually. It's a bit weird to say. But I'm not a fan. There is a big glowy scary thing in the Construction Sayama system. Complete. Like it's a I don't know, it's it's a, a moo alien. It is literally just a ball of lightning. Shocking. Oh yeah, I discovered that. Was that in the Gargantua system? Or near it or somewhere? I don't know, it's lurking around there. It's the second time I've flown into it. I was wondering what that was. Is this in my empire now? Yes! In Mercy Confederacy space. Beautiful. So now I can slowly start getting more things. I'm doing okay for minerals. For energy credits even, even though look at this, pop maintenance. Minus 9.9 .9 a month. Jeez. Oh, failed. Oh well. Forgive and forget. I'm quite gracious. So yeah, if you're watching on stream and you have questions, Ask them, and I may be able to answer them. I'm loving the appropriate icon for the Mercy Confederacy. Which one? The uh, the sword with the wings. The sword with the wings. Yeah, yeah. it's perfect. Isn't it? They are just Mercy bots, though. <laughs> the avian robot phenotype. If robots oh, could actually wing. have phenotypes, yeah. Want to buy more minerals? Hey, I have some. Want to trade? <laughs> I have what? plenty of everything because everything's going so slowly. Do you want me to up the speed? No, it just takes a long time for yeah. a robot to build, for a planet to colonize. Ooh, I do have. Yeah, okay, I do have some. It's fine. 
Yeah, my colony's still taking forever. Yeah, so is mine. Ether Drake. Oh, it was. It was missing one. There we go. System survey complete. Oh, there goes my fleet. <laughs> yeah, here goes the other I found the scary sparkly thing again, the Moo aliens, which I should probably just suck it up and research to find out what they are. Some sort of space cow? Space Communications cow. alert. <laughs> Such agreement, that'll, that'll be fine. Goodness gracious, great balls of energy. Hmm. Yeah, well, it's vaguely heading your way, so. Wait, this cloud is moving? Yeah. Okay. Yay, gargantua system. Hooray. Now I kind of want my science ship to go. Uh... Communications alert. Oh, hello. This is. Oh, a foreign entity has decrypted our communications. So I don't really want to go down this route because there is nothing there for me. I would quite like my science ship to come back up here and start surveying these for me. Possible further expansion routes. Ah. Do this in Veldoon. More research speed. Research it. Research speed. Technological wisdom. acquisition successful. What do I have now? Research speed plus five. Yay, primitives. Nom, 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 mm, synchronized defense is pretty good, but. First, you probably have to predict it like you're one of them. Oh, they're fungus. Even better. There's fungus among us. The atomic age fungus. What? What? <laughs> do not trust them. <laughs> this is the point where they just like massively do a burst of like growth. Planetary surface Radioactive settlement established. Yeah, powered by a nuclear missile. Yeah, my colony's finally done. I am going to build a spaceport immediately. So what have I got? I popped on a uh, energy credit tile, which is amazing. I can't clear any of the blockers. Construction there. complete. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, what? Oh man. I don't have enough minerals. <sighs> nuclear weapons may be prolific and could result in a sudden extinction effect. Oh, more evil aliens that just ate my last Corvette. No. Someone's weak. The, time, the time to strike is now. But, 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 but it's not potatoes. Leave me alone. It's, it's <laughs> easier to, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's easier to integrate machines in the machine society. I don't know. Go on. I mean, like... I think it would be really difficult to integrate fish into a human society, for example. That wouldn't stop them trying. No, it wouldn't stop anyone trying, but it would probably take longer. I've only found one other player. And they've got an entirely different social structure. You find Come on, construction ship. Do your job. So we can go colonize these other planets. Ah! Okay. Uh. Uh. Ah, colony established. <laughs> the spud <Hello>. top authority. <laughs> That's brilliant. Potatoes have been sighted. Potatoes spotted, sir. Ah. Been oh, it's probably the governor of my planet who just died. Hmm, that sucks. Ah, please build me more minerals. <laughs> Stupid sexy alien business. Construction oh, complete. Hello. Good, excellent. You there. Go get me some more of the beautiful minerals. Uh, let's see. Finally finish inhabiting a planet. Yikes. Oh, the spaceport. System survey complete. Never not spaceport. Ooh, let's see dings. Um, I need to just quickly check some thing. Uh... Yeah, my new colony finally gave me some s systems that <laughs> actually had something in them except for barren rocks. As opposed to non barren rocks? Yeah, rocks with minerals on them. Uh -huh. Or alien goop inside. Alien goop, best goop? I would know. There you go. 
important information being relayed. Construction complete. Construction complete. What, what was I building on something? Uh, oh, oh, I missed that. I should probably... The machine voice just sounds like someone underwater. Every time I hear it, it's got my immediate thought is like... Mm, I've got another colony ship walking. rather than that. Yeah, it does have that kind of wall arc effect to it. <laughs> Ooh, what's that? Ooh, it's a 21! I might have to snipe that. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, before they get there, too. Right, okay, let's start saving Fusion them. reactors! Fusion! Construction complete. Excellent. So, uh, I could build things here. Ah, exploratory firm firmware 2.0. Oh, another hive mind, really. There are many of them. If one is taking the overpowered races. Except for the potatoes. Because they are potato tech. <laughs> potato sounds. Hey, construction ship. Oh, of course, I told you to, but you didn't. I'm saving up. God damn it. God damn colony ships costing so much. Whenever you're done. Oh, you're done with your spaceport. Excellent. I'm probably wasting more minerals now, but trust me, it'll be worth it in the long run. Planetary alert. Tile blocker expunged. Excellent. Uh, we the depth. Uh, begins precursors chain. Good. I'm gonna ignore Oh, that the is the best chain. What? What's that? You can easily see player empires now on the uh, contact screen. I look differently. Oh yeah. Mm. Let's do non-aggression pact with the potatoes. Hmm. Let's see. Wow. Hive mind is like neutral thoughts. I still haven't found anyone yet except for the fallen empire next to me. Unlocking robo modding. That sounds cool. Robo modding! <laughs> see, as you can plainly see, this one has a racing stripe. <laughs> <laughs> this one has a spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> Observe the downforce. <laughs> Just put him in a hole! Construction complete. Hell teaches larger fans. Yes, there okay, we go. Agreed on the Griffin <laughs> Pact. Excellent. Mm -hmm. I I really want to secure this system. Communications alert. But mm, they are expanding quite aggressively. I do want this system. Damn it! All the projects I'm finding are like little fun. To frontier outpost. It's a research. Screw it. Yeah, do it. which is good system. and bad. A foreign entity has decrypted our communications. Which again, is good and bad at the same time. I haven't found a single precursor one. Well, there were no precursors. Robots were always robots. I got three precursors so far. It sounds like, uh, it sounds like machine heresy to me. <laughs> Machines are always and eternal. Always were, always will be. <laughs> oh dear. Do not question the robots. <laughs> or else face kicking unit will kick your face. <laughs> We have adapted for just this occasion. <laughs> <laughs> Extend no foot. Extend no foot. <laughs> That's where they get all transformers on your ass and turn to a big like attack thing. But still lux luxurious in the process. Oh, of course. Construction complete. Oh, my God, so slow. What was I building? Ah, I was upgrading, of course. So, you... I need to stop spending... A minerals. Of surface variable detected. Mm, but, but look at this, seven minerals. Seven minerals in here. 